What is going on guys? It's Sook and I am back with a brand new video on Super Duper Tech. And in today's video, I will be unboxing the 2017 4K iMac. So without any further ado, let's hit the titles. The iMac that I will be unboxing in today's video is the £1,449 model. And for that price, you will get a 3.4 gigahertz quad core Intel i5 processor, which is capable of boosting all the way up to 3.8 gigahertz. You do also get eight gigabytes of DDR4 2400 megahertz RAM. You do also get a one terabyte fusion drive along with Radeon Pro 560 graphics with four gigabytes of dedicated graphical memory. And of course you do get the improved 21 and a half inch 4K retina display, which has a resolution of 4096 by 2304. But enough of talking about the specs, let's crack open the box and see what actually comes included with the iMac. Now the first thing that you do get is a box which contains a number of different things from the keyboard to the mouse. But we'll place that to a side and see what else is actually in the box. Now removing the iMac from the packaging and placing the box to a side, we do get a closer look at what other things come included with the iMac. Now taking a closer look at the back of the iMac inside the styrofoam, you will find the single power cord, which of course will be used to turn on the iMac. Also, this cable does have an approximate length of around one and a half meters. Next up, you will need to remove the styrofoam packaging from around the hinge on the iMac to allow it to move freely. And once you have removed the styrofoam packaging, there is yet more packaging that you must remove. Now along with a piece of fabric that covers up the entire body of the iMac, you will need to remove a piece of plastic that covers the entire display area of the Mac. And you'll find more of this packaging around the stand. So lastly, let's bring back that box that we first pulled out from the packaging and see what actually comes included with the iMac. Now, as I said, you do get the keyboard and mouse in this box. Now, of course, both of these are wireless and they are the same ones that shipped with the previous generation iMac. That means that you do get the stupidly placed lightning connector on the Magic Mouse. The next item in the box is of course the keyboard. Now I was hoping that Apple would introduce a keyboard with the touch bar like we have with the new generation MacBook Pros. So we may have to wait a few more years for Apple to finally introduce the touch bar for their desktop Macs. And of course, like the previous generation, you do have a lightning port to charge up the keyboard. Now underneath where the keyboard was, you will find the documentation envelope. And of course, within this, you will find a number of different documents. And the first of these is your quick start guide, which is shortly followed up by details of your Apple limited warranty in both English and French. You then get two white Apple stickers, as well as a microfiber cleaning cloth. Next up, you do get a lightning cable, which does have an approximate length of around one meter and is of course going to be used to charge up both your mouse and your keyboard and under that you do get some regulatory information on both the mouse and the keyboard so then guys that has been it for today's video i do hope you did enjoy it if you did enjoy it then make sure you smack that like button and if you want you around here then why not subscribe if you have got any questions or queries then leave them down below and if you do want to see what video i am working on next and be sure to add me and follow me on my social media. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.